back to EBS class. See, today we will talk and learn about the clothes. What are the clothes we wear in different seasons? And how do we make clothes? And what are the different kinds of clothes? See, we wear different kinds of clothes. See, these clothes, it protect us from the heat, cold and rain. So, uh, now let's discuss about first the clothes which we wear in different seasons. See, here we have summer, that is cotton cloth. See, during summer, in summer, we wear uh, light and cotton cloth. This cotton clothes, this, uh, it protect us from the heat. It make us cold. It, see, during this summer, we also like to swim in a swimming pool. So, we wear swimming costumes in the swimming pool. And during this summer, we wear like sunglasses, the hearts and umbrellas to protect ourselves from heat. So, this was about the summer season which we wear that is cotton clothes. Next, we have that is in winter season, we wear woolen clothes. See, during winter, we wear woolen clothes. These woolen clothes, it keep us warm. And uh, we wear different kinds of woolen clothes like sweaters, mufflers, scarf, jacket, long coat, etc. During this winter season. So this was about the winter season that we wear woolen clothes. Next we have rainy season. See during rainy season we use raincoat and umbrella. See we use this raincoat to make us dry and we use umbrella to protect ourselves from the rain. So this was about the clothes which we wear in different seasons. Next we have that is how do we make clothes, making of a clothes. That means how do we make clothes. See this cotton clothes, how do we make this cotton clothes. See this cotton, it is uh, found, we get this cotton from the cotton plant. See uh, this cotton plant which we get from the cotton plant. It is made what? Cotton thread. It is said to be spinning. See? Spinning. And again next, uh, the process by which this cotton thread, which is made up of uh, clothes. This cotton thread, it is made up of cotton clothes. It is called weaving. And next we have the wool. That means woolen clothes. See this woolen clothes. Okay, this wool from where do we get? We get from the sheep's hair. See the process by which we get uh, the sheep's uh, hair which is collected uh, is known as what? Herring. Which is collected from the sheep. It is called herring. And the sheep's hair it is clean and it is made up of a it is made for a woolen thread in machines and this woolen thread it is needed to make woolen clothes like sweaters, uh, caps, socks etc. by this wool, woolen. This uh, woolen can be knitted at home or they can be made in the factories also. Next we have silk. See, silk we get from the silkworm. Yes, we weave the silk thread to make uh, different kinds of clothes like saris, skirts and kurtas. So, this was the silk. That is how we make different kinds of clothes. Next, we have uh, different kinds. What are the different kinds of clothes we have? See, first we have uniform. See, people wear uh, different dresses, special dresses or common dresses which the people wear and go to different works. Uh, like if we see the person, what the dress she or he wears, then we can recognize that what works she do, what works he do. So, uh, like we can say the doctor, they have the uniform dress, common dress. 
and the students also they have uniform dress, common dress, and the pilot, the lawyer, and uh, the policeman. They have these common dresses. That is the uniform. Next we have traditional dress. See, people wear different dresses in different places. Like each country has a special dress, which is called the traditional dress, which the people wear different dresses. In each country, they have different dresses, that is traditional dresses. Like kilt, this kilt is the traditional dress of Scotland. And uh, like the sari, it is the traditional dress of the Indian women. And uh, so this way it has different traditional dress which people wear in different countries. So children, this uh, was the topic which we have talked about the clothes, about the different clothes which we wear in different seasons and uh, how to make the clothes and next we have talked what are the different kinds of clothes. Hope so you all understood this topic of clothes. Thank you.